I'm doing a small hike today to this volcano which you see which you see in front of you. It's called uh, Northern Erzberg Volcano. It erupted 1,000 years ago and it flooded enormous territory. I'll show you. you see all this valley was flooded from this crater that was erupting exactly 1,000 years ago when Iceland adopted Christianity. That's why this lava field is called Christianization lava field or Christni Turku ruin. Sometimes they call it also Svina ruin, swine lava field. So we will get to the top of this volcano to get to the top. Today, what is here in the mountains? In Reykjavik, it was bad. So here, uh, up in the mountains, it's always colder than this morning. So, to follow this hike to get to this name, Elderly Elbork, which means Northern Elbork. Elder is fire in Icelandic. You can translate it as fire, mountain, something. So we are getting to the top of this volcano to get the view. No more lava is coming, so it's under Christian say. I was driving from Reykjavik home when I stopped it just to take this hike to film it. Actually, I've never been here, so I drive so often by this road and never took this hike. But since there is so much interest in the volcanoes, I will film it for you. So we're hiking up the crater. I'll show you the crater itself. Lots of wind today, there's some snow. Unusual for April. So, same conditions are also uh, at Galdingadal because we are just 15 kilometers away. Here it's just a small hike. So, here we are coming to the top of this crater, massive crater, which comes from lava. Flooded all this valley, several square kilometers big. And here you see the crater, Northern Airport crater.
taken back from the crater uh, help the crater not uh, getting the other crater this crater is 1000 years old I uh, just took a small hike today and it has been snowing as you see here in the mountains it was a strong wind but now it stopped and we have a sunshine again It's two kilometers hike from the highway. I was just driving home and did this small hike. You see how much lava is here. Pile it up. Masses of lava. One thousand years old from the times of uh, settlement of Iceland, but when Iceland adopted Christianity in the year one thousand, that's why this lava field is called you know, Christianization lava field or Trisnitjokuhroi. They also call it Svinahroi, which means swine lava field. So on the maps, it's usually marked as uh, Svinahroi. It's a very tricky hike, you don't want to see the machine on the lava field. They are all over the place. There you see the crater in the distance. That's where the lava was coming from. Tricky uh, hike is because there are so many rocks and it's very uneven surface, not so easy to move, you can stumble very easily. This is all what grown in 1000 years in the lava fields. From here you see the crater also very well. Near Tri El Pork Crater, Northern Fire Mountain, if you translate. Market hiking trail. It's popular among residents of Reykjavik to hike here. Maybe not today because weather has not been so good last days. It's been raining, snowing, hailing, everything. Very changeable weather in Iceland. Be very strong wind with snow and then five minutes later sunshine and still weather like today beautiful scenery big mountains this mountain is called Lombofet or the Lamb Mountain there is a big mine just on the other side where the mine rock for the road works. And the 
little bit further there is a geothermal power plant you see steam is coming from the geothermal power plant of Hankis Haiti which produces electricity and hot water for the residents of Reykjavik this is the landscape Svina growing lava field crystallization lava field the crater actually there are two of them there and there is a bit further there is one more crater it's called southern Eldborg I didn't reach that I just walked to this one there on top <laughs> really bad weather hit direction about 50 kilometers I plan to make another hike to the volcano to film lava on Tuesday probably when I expect the best weather so I hope to upload more videos of lava It is here in the lava fields. This is a relatively new lava field, 1000 years. It's not so old in historical terms. So, it's the new it is, the more beautiful it looks. It's a very thick pile of moss that grows on the lava fields. It's very soft. See, very soft also here. Very soft moss. There's another crater. So holes, cavities, cracks all around. Okay, I keep walking. Don't do it. 